Welcome to my channel, Planning with Maserati. I'm going to be showing you a um, personal and family devotions for January through March of 2023. I don't know if I'll get any of the other months, but for now, I got this one, which is, I think, a little copy here, as well as the larger copy. I was hoping it would fit in my planner, Unless I cut pages to re-hole punch. Because a lot of it does fit. As you can see, it's not that bad. But it would be like... Cutting side, cutting here. Which is not too bad. Okay, so let's start with the bigger book. The little book, I think, is the same. So, I mean, there's pretty much... I'll just, like, flip through a little bit of it. It's a little bit on the bent side, but that's okay. So, you have Meet the Altars. Um, Order of Family Worship. Leader in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. All Amen. Leader with repeating each phrase, so I don't know if this is Catholic, Lutheran, or whichever. And then you got Mar Mar Martin Luther's morning prayer, his evening prayer, mealtime prayers, asking children and members of the household, returning thanks, and then it starts with the devotional. So this one may be a little different. And then, but first pray, undeserving. So as you're seeing, and then in the back here, after you get past the 31st, you have Sunday morning, Sunday evening. And then I think it's like a weekly thing. Monday morning, evening, Tuesday morning, evening. And then... To Thursday, Saturday, so it's like Friday morning, Saturday morning, evening, and then midday, noon, prayer at midnight, the baptism of our Lord. So I think this is so the purification of Mary. By the sick. After surgery. So like you have different prayers. In here. Oh that one looks good too. I might try to order that. Grace under pressure. Stress makes a ungraceful. Makes us ungraceful. That's the website to that. I don't know how you can order this. Like for prisoners. For help at times of temptation, for pen penitent and heart, the mission for missionaries, for our pastors. I think it would have said for our priest if it was Catholic, right? If I'm not mistaken. For our enemies, for the peace of Christ, the right service of God. And then there's the book. So this one's a little, I think, different than this one, but it's the same cover. Okay. So here we have the bear one. The bear one opens up with peace and protection. A 52 week, a 52 devotions by women who walk in faith. Walk your path. What am I saying? 52 devotions by women who walk your path. Peace and protection. And it's at the cph.org. Let's see if the cover is the same. So the cover is the same. So we'll kind of like flip through a little bit. So here you have, again, Meet the Authors, which is the same page as this one, but smaller. Meet the Authors. So there's three of them. So it does have like subscriptions and stuff and if you order in bulk it's cheaper 
So if you wanted a one year subscription of a regular print edition is available for eighteen fifty. A digest print edition is available for nineteen fifty. A large print edition is available for the visually impaired with one year subscription twenty dollars and fifty cents. Not bad. And again, meet the altars. So it's kind of like um our daily bread. So Order of Family Worship. Martin Luther King. So yeah, it's the same. And then it goes into mealtime. And then day one. Which is... Right here. Life in his name. So this one I'll carry with me. And then this one I will just, you know, read here. So you have... For your day one, you read Luke 2.20... 221 Psalm 8. So you're reading Luke 221 and Psalm 8. And then it has scripture, life in his name, devotional with, you know, Acts 412. When I see scripture like this, I like to um, highlight it and then go back later and you could write it out or whatever. And then, dear Lord, help me. So it's a prayer. Dear Lord, help me live this new year in the powerful name of your son, Jesus. Amen. And then it's just so pretty. But first pray, and that's exactly right. We're supposed to be praying. And then you, it, there's no, like, Bible in a year. So, like, reading the Bible in a year, it's just, just straight. Prayer on the bottom, devotional, and scripture on top. So we'll keep flipping. So ordinary stability. Hopefully you're going to see both sides. I'm cooking right now, so I'm trying to like watch that as well. I'm making um, jambalaya. Eternal words. So we'll get into like the middle of January, or well, the ending of January, gentleness, God's rod and staff, which God do you serve? So that's one of my grad school English classmates said, I think everyone has a religion if you find meaning in life from nature or Buddhism or the Bible or academics or whatever then that's your religion. That's your God. So Martin Luther actually said something similar. A God means that from which we are expect all good and in which we are to take refuge. Okay, so this is what confuses me. Thursday, the purification of Mary and the presentation of our Lord. But then it says divine intervention. But none of these say that, like, on top. So, and then there's a baptism. So if you know, like, what uh, faith base this is, is it like I was saying earlier? What nomination? Decluttering. I definitely need that. Art appreciation. The winter of my soul. Oh my gosh. Tell me about it. The basement doctor. It should say. The Google doctor, because I'm constantly Googling. But that is the book. Um, again, this is the same thing that I showed you in the last one. I'm just trying to like flip through so you could see some more stuff. And then Marge, Salt Preserves. So I'm going to look it up and see. No wine. Get up and walk. That's what my doctor tells me all the time. Bittersweet farewell. Daily bread, our heart bypass. And there you have it. That is what I just wanted to jump on real quick and show you. 
I'll show you the information, you know, if you're interested in, I guess, ordering it for yourself. So that's all saying, like, I don't know if it's Lutheran or if it's, uh, what is that, Baptist? Is it Catholic? But it's called Portals of Prayer for personal and family devotions. So this is the one that goes January through March. So thank you for watching. I hope you uh, like this video. Hope you understand. Hope you like this video. Give it a big thumbs up. Leave a comment. Share the video. That would be greatly appreciated. As always, thank you for watching. So if you see me working on this book, you'll know. And I think with this, I'm going to probably have to write it out. Because I don't have my hole puncher with me. Everything is put away. Like, literally, put away. But I would love to, like, not chop the book down, but, like put this in the happy planner because you have plenty of room to hole punch plenty of room and this would be a great resource in my book so thank you and i'll talk to you later have a good one bye bye